Mel Jr. and Todd McShay joining us this morning. Mel, Florida State is coming off an impressive win over Clemson. They hit the road for the first time this weekend against South Florida. The Knowles have dealt with big expectations before and they have faltered. So after four weeks of action, does this team have what it takes to make a, a national title run and unseat the recent SEC dominance? Well, I think they will be a team that will be in the national championship game. I thought that back in August. I picked them to play LSU, and I'm going to stay with that based on the fact this is a different team than last year. They have proven that already. Down 28-14 to to Clemson. They rallied and dominated that football game. And a couple things they showed is SEC speed, and they've shown also SEC depth. When you lose a Brandon Jenkins, a great defensive end, great pass rusher, then a Tank Carradine steps in and you don't miss a beat. Greg Reed on the back end of cornerback, also in the return game, dismissed from the football team, yet you're still playing at this high level. E.J. Manuel, quarterback, has stepped up his game. Thompson's given him a home run hitter in the backfield. I think Florida State is a national championship contender definitively, Todd, and I think they have a great opportunity with this schedule, which is very favorable, to run the table. I think I'm going to start keeping a Kuiper preseason FSU tracker and just kind of <laughs> tick it every single time you mention that you picked them in the preseason. And also see later in the year if they do lose a game, if you keep mentioning it. Mm -hmm. okay. For Florida State, I think they do have the talent. I think that they're, they're close, if not there, in terms of the talent that they've developed over the last few years. Their recruiting classes have been outstanding. You're seeing the depth there. The second half last week, I finally saw the swagger. You know, go back to the late 80s, the 90s, when Florida State was the team to beat, when Florida State had the athletes and the depth, and they were rolling down in, in Tallahassee. They had that swagger. And as you saw the same thing in the second half, all the NFL guys on the sidelines, you felt like Florida State is finally back. I think, again, the talent's there. Can they maintain consistency, and do they have the leadership I think E.J. Manuel plays the biggest part in all of this, not only his consistency on the field, but his leadership off the field, keeping this team focused each and every week because they have a legitimate chance to be undefeated going into that Florida game, and then we'll find out a little bit about them against SEC competition and whether they deserve to get into a national championship situation beyond that. All right, Mel, yesterday 